Heartland agriculture has many flavors, but the richest ingredient may be the faces we seldom see, the faces that feed us. It's a story being told here at the Vacaville Museum. Gold has been discovered in Solano County. The gold being culled from Solano's soil is the county's rich contemporary and historic orchard industry. The Vacaville Museum has put together a photographic and documentary wealth of agricultural history in a new exhibit, Solano's Gold, The People and Their Orchards. Over a three-year span, working alongside the growers, photographer Philip Adam documented Solano's story through his camera lens. They were a vital group with a tremendous strength. A lot of them are in their 60s and 70s and still working the land and very optimistic about the future, some of them. Um, it, wasn't, it wasn't the farmers of the 30s. It was a different breed altogether. I wanted to show them, I wanted to show that strength and vitality that they have. I couldn't help but be moved on an emotional level um, from the trees and the harvest activities. Uh, I found it to be a very beautiful experience. We wanted to show partly the changes that have occurred in the orchard industry, but also how much has stayed the same way. A lot of the work methods still are the same methods that uh, existed 100 years ago. Agriculture definitely forms a big part of it and is still a big economic factor in the county today. And, but it's also becoming more and more endangered. The trees were coming out as we were working. And signage was popping up everywhere in Green Valley and Fairfield, uh, land for sale, corporate park. The inspiration for this collection came from the creative talents of author and oral historian Kristen Delaplane. We had a roundtable discussion where we invited local farmers and people in the fruit industry and they gave us a list of people that we might want to contact and also of artifacts that might be available. In the process it became very obvious that the fruit industry had been one of the biggest money makers for the county. We put together a plan for doing this. The idea, of course, is to retain our history and to have it chronicled. Ms. Delaplane is putting the finishing touches to a book that will be released on July 4th in conjunction with the run of the exhibit that opened in March and continues until January of 2000. At the turn of the century, Solano County was known as the Orchard of America. The orchards still play an active role in the county's economic and cultural health, even though urban growth has reduced their yield. This display of Solano's gold will hopefully help us maintain what's left. <laughs>